how to make this from these materials only in your mobile device hey guys welcome back to make a thumbnail we need three main things a background which we are going to use this overlays which we use to colorize our theme you can get best gradient overlays like this from this website for free and we need objects such as character, text, and etc. Okay, let's go and make our thumbnail. Open PixArt application and add the background image. Go to Effects and in B and W tab, select black and white filter. It will make our background texture. Save it and add it as an overlay to the project and make it full screen go to adjust and make the brightness around minus 80 and click apply now we can add our theme color to it easily now let's add our main character and we are going to place it right here but before let's remove its background select the character like this click next and fix the cutout like this. Okay, now we are good to go. Let's add our text now. Add a stroke around 20. I love this font. It is called Luckiest Guy. It is built in font in Big Art and you can use it for free. Let's change the secondary text color to gradient. This thumbnail theme is orange and yellow, so I choose these colors. Let's add shadow to our text like this. Now duplicate the text and adjust text shadow like this and remove the stroke. Place on top of the main text. It will create a cool 3D style. Let's do it with secondary text too. Alright, perfect. Now let's add our overlay. Bring it behind the object. I want it to have more orange colors, so I drag it like this. Now let's make it overlay. I think something is missing in this corner. Let's add some logo and make its overlay it's better now now let's add a lens flare i suggest you to use this one scale it like this and change its color to match the theme color now bring it behind the character you can play around with lens color to find your perfect match with theme color okay let's adjust the character lightning these settings may really depend on your theme color. So try to play with settings until you find your good results. I think it's perfect now. Alright, to much better, let's use a trick. Duplicate the character, select the main one and in blend mode apply hard light. Now place the duplicated one on top of it. Decrease opacity around 90. It look much better now. Let me know what you think in comment section. Alright, let's save it. And this is our final result. Be sure to subscribe for more contents like this. Best of luck and have a good day.